Hey guys, this is obviously um, Lucario Brawler 1, and this is just a tutorial how to stream. Um, on my stream tonight, I had quite a few people asking me, I think quite most, quite a lot of them anyway, and I'm just going to be showing you how to. Okay, so you're going to need what, um, one program that really matters, and it's called Manicam. Okay, so I have it, and if I open it up, I get a screen like this. Now, usually, it'll be like this and it'll be using camera okay just ignore that I was um, recording a uh, your stream and I was putting the mic to my speaker so they could hear Josh Emot which is Buzator talking because he was co-hosting okay so um, when you get this you're gonna want to click desktop then you'll have three options full desktop Partial desktop and custom desktop. Um, you can choose custom desktop to like select a place like this, for example. Um, you can choose how big you want it to be. It can be any size you want, except from smaller than that. Okay, so um, you can have partial desktop, which follows your mouse around. Or you can have full desktop, which is like uh, using Camtasia full screen. I don't believe you can record using this though. So yeah, and um, what to get Manicam? You're gonna want to open up um, your a new tab. Since I got Google Chrome, I just type in Manicam download. Um, but if you're using others like Firefox and stuff, you'll have to go to Google. So Manicam free download. Two seconds. And then you see the very first one. Click on it. Then you're gonna click download now. Okay. Um, it'll open up here. It's 14.26 megabyte. You'll download it, which I'm not gonna bother doing. Okay. So I'm just gonna discard. Since I already have it, then once you've got that downloaded, if you've got to broadcast now, skip there, or unless you want to tell people on Twitter, and this will come up. If you wait a few seconds, then it'll come up with stuff like this info. Um, it comes up with this, just click allow. Um, usually, for me, usually it, it was like that. As you can see, um, it was Sigma Tail audio for that. Um, but if you change it to your microphone and then with Manicam open, you can you click on Manicam virtual webcam, and then this will pop up. Then after that, make sure you have video broadcast and audio broadcast click and click start broadcast. I'm not going to do that right now because there's no one on mine. Well, there probably is actually someone. But yeah. And um, from here you can do polls. Put in the question, put in the options they can choose. You can do um, text and you can put in videos and that. You can put stuff on Twitter telling people that you're doing it. Um, audience tools. You can pick someone on your stream to sh um, be a co-host. Or you can advance settings, which is just like frame rates, smoothing, and sound mixers. Um, yeah, so basically, if you start a poll down at the bottom of the page with the poll, down here, there will be stop broadcast, um, stop poll, click that, stop it, and then really it just goes on from there, and then it will say remove. Um, I just leave that local monitor. Seems simpler for me, but um, yeah, that's pretty much it. You can choose what you're broadcasting, get higher quality. You can record to put videos on it. Simple. Okay, guys, thanks for watching, and um, I'm sure there will be a few more tutorials to come for this. Bye, guys.